all in all, it's not only a clean energy benefit for Canada and Alberta, it's also an economic benefit. Amazon is investing big in its first Canadian wind farm in southern Alberta. The tech giant announcing a $478 million investment Thursday, which will help to develop 83 wind turbines in Vulcan County. The company says the project will go through despite a six-month ban on new renewable energy projects in the province. All four of Amazon's renewable energy projects in Canada predate this moratorium. So we understand that the government is taking time to review their regulatory policies that they use to approve projects. But these projects were already in the queue. The Alberta government confirming that reality to City News, saying construction on the project began in 2022 and will not see impact from the pause. Amazon will team up with Copenhagen Infrastructure Partners in developing the farm, which will have an energy capacity of 495 megawatts. What this means for Alberta, it means that Amazon's operations locally are being powered by this clean energy but it also means that homes, small businesses, the communities that also use power from this grid are benefiting from that clean energy as well. The Buffalo Plains Wind Farm will be located 130 kilometers southeast of Calgary. The project follows the opening of the $700 million Traverse Solar Farm, also located in Vulcan County, which is the largest of its kind in the country. Traverse Solar Farm that we invested in created about 750 jobs during peak construction. And for our new wind farm, Buffalo Plains, we expect that will probably create around 300 jobs during peak construction. The wind farm is expected to be completed by 2025 as Amazon hopes to hit its net zero goal in the same year. In Calgary, Tate Lakecraft, City News.